Yes, yes, welcome in everyone. It's the one Verna Bachelor, 37 steps up high above the city. It's Stock Talk, Wednesday, September 9, 2020. This is episode 9. Let's get right to it. Monday, the holiday. That night we did a show. We got all fired up for the upcoming week. And just before we went on the air and recorded last night, Monday night's episode had a record of four comments, seven new subscribers, and 581 views. So we did the show, made some predictions, talked about good things, and yesterday things didn't go so well. Tesla, Apple, Peloton did well, we'll get back to that, and CureVac, none of those did very well. And so like it was my fault, as we start the show tonight, last night's episode had only one comment. We actually lost two subscribers, and we only had 84 views. And this 581 has actually gone up to 668 from Monday night's episode during the day today. So, well, if that's an indication of maybe we'll get some new subscribers, maybe we'll get a lot more comments, maybe we'll get a lot more views if the news is good, then we should do pretty well today. How about this? Yay! All right, Tesla opened at three thirty and twenty one cents, closed at three sixty six twenty eight. Nice. Apple closed at one twelve eighty two yesterday, closed today at one seventeen thirty two. Nice. Peloton, the exercise bike machine at home. Yikes. It's gone up nice, gone up nice, up again today. We've got some little asterisk next to it, though. That's a star, actually. That goes up. And CureVac, the vaccine company which we're sticking with, was up very well before the weekend and had a couple of rough days so far this week. And that actually closed at 55.21, down a little bit today. But um, that's all right. So... What I'm going to do here is I'm going to grab a pen. Yikes. Okay. And just total this up. 28, 60, 77, 98 is the cents here. And 366, 483, 574, 629. Okay. So 629, 98 is now what? The one of each of these shares that we spent 683.36 on. So we're down a little under $64, a little under $54. We're still two more days to go in the week. We're probably not. We'd have to double Tesla to reach our goal of 731. We'd have to 90% increase on Apple to get to our 207. Peloton has a good shot few points each day like it's been going up. We could hit that $100.79 per share. And CureVac needs to get it going. It's been down these couple of days, but we're staying with it. One of these vaccine companies is going to pop. I read in the news or have been following these guys just for the last couple of weeks that they could be the one. So that's what we're going with. Um, good luck, everyone. Stay patient. Hopefully you still had a few eggs in those split baskets. Because, yes, we did buy a, some more Tesla, Tesla, some more Apple, some more Peloton. We're holding off on the CureVac just to see what happens. But, um, yikes, we're buying lower to sell higher. And, yes, Tesla was up today. And, yes, Apple was up today. But when we're talking about buying lower and selling higher, we're looking at 418 still down to 366, 120 still down up to 117. All right, and we're buying Peloton because it's on the way up. Another good reason to buy it. It's got plenty of room to run. Okay, thanks again, everyone. Stock Talk, Episode 9. Love you, Angelo. Check us out on YouTube and on Instagram. Of course, Gene and my friend Booster from Boost Mobile. Spreadshirt.com, the Lucky Day Baseball Series. Hey, we sold another shirt. Yes, over at, it's now 
Hyde Park Convenience Store. Speaking of Hyde Park Convenience Store, Hyde Park Emergency Food Pantry, please support your local food pantry. I'm just now called the Hyde Park Convenience Store that was in our convenience store. And we sold the Bats t-shirt. Awesome. So we're starting to gather up some monies to get to the Hyde Park Emergency Food Pantry. Okay, that's it, everyone. We'll see you tomorrow night for episode 10. Hopefully there's more green. Hopefully we're closer to these totals. And let's just get higher than we started the week. We'd be happy with that. Okay, everyone, stay safe, be good to each other. We'll see you next time on Stock Talk.